Let's see if we can catch him. What do you think? Think we're going to catch him? There he is right there. Might be able. Shout out to Marco Pedrana and all our channel members. Join channel memberships. Links in the description. Welcome back F1 Manager family to another F1 Manager video. In today's video, we're doing our opening round for the Community Choice British Grand Prix. All right. So for this GP, uh, for the opening round, we're going to be using the power level tune. Yeah, we're going back to the power level tune. I know I have been moving around from tune to tune uh, just to see how things are. We're using Hamilton. Uh... Level 5 and Kimi level 8. Uh, but before we jump into that, let's get our asset trading done. You have Vettel in our shop there. Nice. Lewis Hamilton in the asset trading today. Uh, so we're going to take those Hamilton cards. So that brings our Hamilton up to 14. So we're 86 cards away from getting him up to level 6. Let's see if we can get lucky. And get some Lewis Hamilton in our GP rewards today. This week. Alright. So remember to subscribe to the channel. Turn on your post notifications. And also leave a like on the video. Uh, there goes Nate Jones. Who else here that we know? All right, let's jump into our races. Here on the power level two, if our drivers qualify poorly, uh, we're going to be using boost as this is a champions division. Uh, there's no room for arrow in champions. Uh, so if your drivers get a poor qualifiers, you need to help them out by adding some boosts and hoping that they will perform great throughout the race. All right. Let's go. This player is very strong. I guess he has uh, max level drivers or level six drivers. Based off of his previous GP finishes. Yep, told you. Alright, so we're going to give Hamilton some boost here. We're going to give him the downforce and then we're going to give Kimi the hex. We're going up against the best of the best in the game. So we have to give it all we can uh, to get the best results. Let's go Hamilton. Hope Hamilton does not drop back. All right, there he goes picking up. So he's in a good mood today. Uh, his penalty does not dictate his day today. So he, he's in a good mood. So I expect a great race from him. We need to score above 45 and above points. So anywhere between 45, 46, and 47 would be great. Driver's doing really well so far. Going up against Verstappen and Hamilton. Both should be level 6, if not at max level. If they're not at max level, they're at both boat they're both at level six. Trust me on that one. Let's keep the conserve going for three laps. One should go to pit now. Did he? Yes. Mm -hmm. 
Went back to Harters. Maybe this is a bot rival. You still gotta take them very seriously. Though it's a bot rival. As the game will make you lose. We forgot to put in our go to pit orders. Let's put those in. Verstappen looks to be out of tires. Hamilton got by. Pit time is going to be very, very long here. So we're going to be stocking. As we're on the power level tune. Yep, so that stock hurt us a bit there. We're back out in 5th and 10th in our boost phase. No way he's going to be slowing Kimi down or he's going to be slowing Hamilton down. Now to use these boosts and make up some positions. Hopefully our drivers don't get stuck. Come on, Hamilton. Don't be getting stuck here. There he goes, suffering a breakdown. Let's go, Kimmy inside. Good try. Putting those go to pit orders as our drivers make up some positions. Kimmy got up to first place. Here comes Hamilton making up some more positions, hunting down the rivals, Hamilton. Now to go to pit and serve our breakdown. This breakdown is going to hurt. 573. Alright, we're back out in seventh place, so that's really nice. So it's now up to Hamilton to just get by these the two rivals and pick up number four to be at 45. Alright, Vettel. Might go back to pit as it's one lap to go. It's not time to get stuck, Hamilton. Use up that dead fast, get it done inside. Watch that switch he didn't make. Come on, Hamilton seems like he's gonna get stuck here. He should have made the switch nice and easy a while ago, but he didn't make it. And Vettel did not go to pit, as I said, might. So this one does not look good. 42 points does not look good. See Hamilton with the down. He has the dead fast, the most powerful boost in the game, and he's unable to overtake. Extra overtaking. 88 overtaking and look at him suffering struggling it is what it is 43 let's go a bit of, a bit of a waste of our boost there to score only 43 points but when you're going up against level 6 Hamilton and a max level Verstappen yeah you have to do that so he's on this version of the power level tune. And our version should be stronger. Our version is stronger. However, he has the better drivers. Guy at the top. Look at those perfect scores. Only the 8th and the ninth race was a bad race for him. Let's jump into this next one. A few moments later. Your little level 5 Hamilton and your little max level Kimi is no match for Verstappen and Hamilton at level 6 and level 7. Here we see our, our drivers getting destroyed and qualified by another high level Hamilton. 
Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna be putting on a boost. We're we're leaving nothing to chance today. Nothing to chance. This is the champions division. And we are free to play and they are not. <laughs> so we leave, need to leave nothing to chance. Give our drivers the best chance possible to score as high as possible. And that's what we use in boost. Nice drive in here from Hamilton. Good start inside. There we go. All right. So Hamilton got a good start. Kimi also got a good start. Let's cut down our drivers here. Oh, we should put pressure. Let's put pressure. Let's put pressure. Let's put pressure. I'm going to go for three laps of boost. Then I'll come back to conserve. I'm going to put some pressure on. Inside. No, he didn't. Got him now. Nope. Got him now. I see. We must. We should be able to go around on the main straightaway. Let's see. Here we go. Inside now. There we go. No escape in that one, Lewis. Let's put in our go to pit orders. Just cut down Hamilton, so we don't stock. And let Kimi go free. No, we don't need you to go any faster, Hat Lewis. We just need you to chill. Let Kimi go to pit. Nice. Cut Kimi down there. Come on, Lewis, don't get stuck. And cut Lewis down there. Now, this is looking better for our boost. Versus the rival Hamilton and Kimi. Let's use some of that dead fast. To scream around and down. See if we can catch Hamilton while he's in pit. Yes, we did. Cut down there. We're going to use some of this dead fast now to this boost now hex and this dead fast to create some distance so we can go to pit without losing any positions to these to the rival on those hard tires. So we can get at least a 47 here. No breakdowns this time. We didn't even look at the rival. Yeah, we look at the rival car. He was on a version of the power level tune. And our version had a higher reliability. And we suffered the breakdown. As we know, that reliability does not prevent you from suffering a breakdown. It just helps your car to repair faster. That's all it does. We can cut down to conserve now and cruise to the finish. As this one too is secured. Yeah, we're going to be using these boosts. Uh, wherever we see your poor qualifiers, you're going to be giving our, our drivers the best chance uh, to score as possible. Kimmy screaming out that he's low on fuel. Great race. Good thing we put on that pressure in the early. Build out some distance, pick up some positions, get this one too. Good race, bro. Let's look again. Level 6 Hamilton, you guys will see it if it's not at max level. Told you, max level. And that's all we face with the power level tune. Because the power level tune is so strong, all we get is these kind of players, max level. 
a lot of max out epics look at this setup we're lucky that this player is a it, it, it's his bot because there's no way we were gonna beat that and he didn't suffer a breakdown either all right let's jump into this next one let me check for a race crate. No, no race crate. Let's jump into the next one. Two hours later. Go in by the GP strategy. Based off of this rival flags, badges. We can see that this race is going to be a more fairer race. So we might be able to use this race without boost. Let's see the qualifiers. Uh, still got out qualified, but it's okay. We can use this one without boost. This is a more fairer race. This is on level 5 Hamilton with a max level Kimi. Nice pull up start from Hamilton while Kimi is kind of slacking back, slugging back there. Guess the penalties on him. <laughs> there have been some contradictions in Hutch's message on the qualifying the video that we looked at yesterday. Uh, I tried to ask in the live stream what do they mean by the driver's feeling for that day. Uh, they didn't respond but I figure uh, that it's the entire day so if you see a driver slugging off uh, throughout one or a few races then he's gonna slug off for the entire day that's what they they're trying to say however we have seen drivers slugged off in certain races and in the next race he's performing like a monster so it's kind of it's kind of contradictory because if a driver is supposed to be doing bad for a specific day uh, based off of his penalty uh, he then should be should be bad in all the races you you, you used him for on that day uh, but it seems not to be the case because we just seen Lewis Hamilton performing like crap in our first race. Now he's performing really well, better than even Kimi here. So it's a bit it's a bit strange. Let's go into pit here. No stocking. Go, 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 pit crew. Alright, we're back out in 7th. Alright, we're going to be in our boost phase here. Kimi got a slow exit because he got blocked in by AI Kimi. Inside. Come on, Kimi. Come on. Kimi's not having it in this race. Let's give him some help. Focus mainly on him here. Uh, we're going to give him some help. We're going to cut down when he goes into a corner tight. And then we'll boost back up when he's getting out. Inside. Good switch. Good switch. Alright, so Kimmy is back up to scratch. Doing his Kimmy stuff. I see Hamilton and AI Hamilton here. Got him. The only thing I have with the power level tune, if we could increase the pit time on the power level tune, it would be really, really insane. 
but we do not have the parts and we're not lucky enough to get any parts in the la in about the last 10 or so GP events uh, we haven't had a one single part that made any changes to our setup or our drivers we've been using the same level drivers and the same level parts for about the last 10 GP events that we've been using and they're all the same there's we have gotten no reward that have impacted our drivers or no reward that have impacted our parts just my luck <laughs> all right let's go great race so one three here great race 46 points we're gonna need every single point that we get as it's the champions division and we're going up against the best of off the best in f1 manager in the champions division and we we, we kind of really need to restock our dead fast boost the pile is going down as we were not in champions division for the last three gps oh it was a level six hamilton after all and he was also using the power level tune All right, let's get this race created and then let, let's get our next two races done. Let's jump straight back into the event. There is Nate leading us by three points because of that 43, 42 points that we scored, 43 that we scored. But you know what? I'm still happy uh, with my results. Is that Monaco? Yes, it is. Uh, based off of previous experience, Hamilton does not do good on Monaco. All right, let's go. We're going to use them and then we'll we'll make adjustments in the final on the final day seven hours later you'll see if the rival is using Kimi and Albon here you're gonna see for yourself he's gonna get out qualified and I know this information so I'm just gonna be using using him here today and then tomorrow in the final day we're gonna switch him out all right so it was another Hamilton but we're into dry race okay back into wet nice qualifiers from Kimi there all right one minute to sun Kimi messed up the start lose up lost the position Hamilton holding off good on the start it's a wet wet race so he's going to do good anyways. Alchemy suffering here at the start because it's wet. And he was going up against Max Verstappen. Let's go regular drive in here a bit. Cut down. We're going to be using some boosts. Each time we come around here, we're going to use some boosts. Let's see if we can pick up some positions or create some distance. So our drivers don't get pressured. Uh, on that portion of the track we're going to cut down now so we're saving around these corners and then we're boosting back up around those corners around the straightaways yeah Hamilton is gone 
as you can see the rival is kind of doing the same thing to get his drivers to overtake my drivers let's cut down there cut down there I think this is another AI rival he's driving very aggressively so they're on they're definitely on regular driving every single time the rival comes around this corner he boosts up so that's four laps let's cut down Let's cut down the sun is out. We're gonna boost for one more lap and then we're gonna come back to pit the soft tires and boost to the finish on those softs. It's gonna be light rain coming back in. So we should be able to boost the finish on those softs. Let's boost our drivers here straight into pit. Into soft tires. Track should dry up by the time we reach to the pits. And then we're boosting to the finish. We're unable to overtake on this portion of the track. Most of the time, this is a low overtaking portion. Let's hope we don't stop. Go, go, go. There we go. No stocking. Wow, the rival did not go to pit. Nice, the rival did not go to pit. So that's going to leave that position for us to take. Nice and easy. Currently on 41 points. We should be able to take Hamilton on those hards as well. Come on, Hamilton. You can do it. Go wide. There we go. All right, so the rating's coming back down. But we should be able to finish the race. Kimi's up in second place. Currently on 44 here. I doubt Hamilton is going to be able to get by Verstappen as he does not have enough fuel to do so. And Verstappen is on soft tires. He's right behind and he's out of fuel. Yep. Doubt he was going to be able to do so either way. If Verstappen was on like hard tires, then he might have a had a chance. But on those soft tires, he was going to need the fuel. Uh, to do it and we're out all right so at least we got 44 points here we'll take it let's boost from there so we don't lose that position and now you know that once you're racing on monaco you have a level five hamilton He's only going to do good if it's wet. But this should have been a... What, was there anything about wetness for this Monaco race? Didn't notice. Let's look at the rivals. Level 6 Hamilton. Oh, we pressed it off. Without looking at the debriefing. Alright, so Nate got a bad race in that one on Monaco. Yeah, Monaco is a tough one. We got a little better race than Nate, so we got one point above, so it's cut down now to two. Spain as well is a track where Hamilton does not do too well. But we're going to go for it just to show Hamilton does not do too good for Spain. So we're going to need to switch into Albon on the final day for the Monaco and the Spain race. 
two thousand years later. Here we go. Hamilton once again getting out qualified. I was expecting him to get out qualified. Nonetheless, we're gonna use some boost for this one. Mm, let's give Kimmy some extra fuel. And we're also gonna give Hamilton some extra fuel with the incense. Alright, let's give Kimmy the downforce. Let's give Hamilton the downforce. We should have given him the dead fast so he has extra fuel and tire management. But let's go. Mixing up the boost here. I start from Hamilton, switch to the inside. Good. Good inside held there from Hamilton. Did he get up to fifth? No. Alright, we're gonna keep the boost on our drivers here for three laps. So they can make up the most positions possible. If they can, that is. Hamilton still in six. Getting pressured by Bottas. Unable to overtake Vettel there. Keeping that boost going. Kimi got the inside, got that position. Now for Hamilton to pick up one position. Get around this damn Vettel. Inside now. Come on. What tires is he on? Sauce. Alright, they're all on sauce, so they're all going to pit in the third lap. Finally got around Vettel with some DRS help there. Now to pick up Verstappen. Good try. Good try there from Lewis. Kimi picking up Hamilton in the front. Inside now, picking up Verstappen as we're about to go to pit. We all should go to pit. Only Vettel. Oh, Hamilton decides to go for the extra run. Vettel should go for the extra run as well. Oh, Vettel came to pit. Here comes the rival. Hamilton on those hard tires. Good block there from Or Hamilton. And we're going to cut down there and there. Do you guys see that distance that, that has been created by AI Hamilton? Just because he w didn't want to go to pit. Look at that distance. It's almost that we weren't going to catch him. Let's see if we can get him with both our drivers. Let's give some boost to Hamilton. Use his fly down the track to get around. Put back down there. All right, so we got second place. What tires is AI Hamilton on? Sauce. All right, we're gonna boost the, the sixth lap here. So we can start boosting with both our drivers from there and here. Putting those go to pit orders. We wanna create, what I'm trying to do here is for this lap is to create some distance. As you see, the good there's a good distance between Kimi and Hamilton. So there's a nice, distance between the cool air for or Hamilton and Kimi is stuck on AI cars so he's going to be in the hotter here the hotter air so Hamilton should catch up real fast as you could see that's exactly what happened had to slow him down there to prevent stocking and now for him to boost back out and boost to the finish Now for Or Hamilton to hunt down AI Hamilton and he's low on fuel. <clears throat> he does not have any form of extra fuel from boost this time around, so he's low. But Hamilton, let's see if he's gonna go to pit. Nope, he's gonna run it to zero tires. And he's good on managing his tires at max level. 
AI Hamilton tire management is completely different from <laughs> uh, our Hamilton's tire management. You're going to see he's now out of tires. All right. Let's see if we can catch him. What do you think? Think we're going to catch him? There he is right there. Might be able. There we go. We caught him. Great race. Well, that was an awesome final race. Really appreciate you guys for all your support. If you're still here with us, remember to smash that like button if you haven't already done so. Also, leave code word waiting down below to let me know that you made it to this portion of the video. Really appreciate you guys for all your support. Let's look at the rival. Level 5 Hamilton. So this was a fair race. But he has that FX. He has that FX. At level 6. That's what I want. The FX at level 6. This is what the the, the next level of the next. This is the next version for the power level tune. As the FX gives more grip. Than it takes away from the power. So this is a version of the power level tune that we're hunting for. Uh, with that FX level 6. That's going to increase the level of the car. This is why he out qualified us. Because his levels were higher. Alright. His loadout was higher. Alright. So that's going to be it for this video. Let's see where we are. There we are now right on their lead nade. Leading by two points. That's going to be it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. All right.